My name is Derek Handley. I am the CEO and co-founder of a company called The Hyper Factory. And uh, The Hyper Factory is going to be about 10 years old in July. And when we started it in New Zealand, it was uh, really one of the first companies in the world that saw the vision of mobile being an important element to uh, the digital landscape and marketing. Uh, so we started up a company to uh, enable brands to figure out what to do with this. And um, 10 years later, we are the most awarded company in the space globally and uh, have been in the US for about five years and have got clients ranging from you know, Nestle to Kraft to Intel and many other Fortune 100 companies. Uh, we came to the US based on a, a tip. We kind of came in September 2005 to have a look, uh, see what it was like, see what the market was like and uh, we quickly realized that if we came uh, and landed we would be in a really strong leadership position. So about a month later I moved to New York and the rest is kind of history. Where is New Zealand strong over and above what we've traditionally thought of New Zealand being strong at the moment? In the sectors I'm familiar with, uh, which is really about the digital revolution and the revolution of the web and social media, um, there are starting to be pockets of companies that are emerging in online gaming and uh, social gaming. Um, a lot of companies that are starting to take advantage of the mobile revolution and digital revolution and coming to the US to try and see uh, you know, how they can uh, fit it and fight it with the best of them here. Um, they're across a lot of different categories. New Zealand isn't really specializing in any particular category, but there are a lot of companies that are taking advantage of cloud computing and the impending changes that are really creating the new revolution of the web. Uh, and I think from the distance, building those kind of companies that are scalable um, and buildable from overseas, uh, New Zealand will continue to create really powerful uh, small but powerful companies that will eventually become big and famous companies. So a couple of companies I can think of, uh, I think the most, uh, the one with one, a lot, lot of promises is Zero, the online accounting software company started by Rod Drury and backed by uh, Peter Thiel. Um, they've just really recently come to the US, they've been in Australia and the UK and doing really great with their small to medium sized business accounting packages uh, using cloud computing. And uh, the social gaming companies I can think of, uh, one that uh, was just backed by Sam Morgan, but also backed by Disney's Steamboat Ventures is called Small Worlds, uh, doing really well and growing really fast uh, in a really emerging category. Uh, those are two good examples of companies that are out there now that people know of. Um, there's a handful more that I know of that haven't launched yet, but I'm sure we'll all see them in the next three to six months.